My name is State Representative Wes Rutherford, and I welcome you to the sign dedication for the firefighter paramedic Patrick Walterman Memorial Highway. For those of you that don't know, uh, December 28, 2015, correct, 2000, uh, 2015, firefighter paramedic Patrick Walterman gave his life in service to this community, responding to a house fire in which he believed that there were individuals inside. He did not think twice about going in to try to save those individuals and in the process lost his life. He died a hero and a testament to the community that makes Hamilton great. It was my high honor and privilege to work on behalf of the family and his colleagues at the fire department to get this section of Route 4 dedicated in his name so all the future generations of Hamilton can remember his sacrifice and his love for the community. I would like to now introduce Hamilton Fire Chief Mark Mercer to say a few words. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, I'll be very brief. I have just a few things that I'd like to say. Um, I want to welcome the family, um, the fire service community, and our neighbors, our friends, our, our community that's here today as we open, as we dedicate this highway. Um, the few people I'd like to recognize, uh, Representative Rutherford, for the work that he did in getting the bill introduced, the work that was done locally by Isaac Saris, you'll hear from him in a few moments, and the rest of the firefighters and uh, the, the comrade, comrades on the job here. Um, as we dedicate this sign, it means different things to different people. For some, the words that uh, Mr. Rutherford used, duty, sacrifice, and community, all of those things are important. For other people, a different relationship, family, brotherhood, and love. And as we see this sign, we'll remember that and the loss that comes with Patrick's sacrifice. So everybody, welcome. Thank you for being here to support this, uh, this unveiling, this rededication of this stretch of highway for firefighter paramedic Patrick Walterman. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, Isaac Saris from the Hamilton Fire Department will now say a few words on behalf of the family. Hello, Isaac Saris, Hamilton Fire Department, Local 20, and most importantly, I'm the liaison for the Walshman family. Uh, ever since that tragic day, I've been able to work very close and become part of their family, and it's one of the greatest honors that I have. They wanted me to reach out to everyone and say thank you for, once again, the continued support that you show their family and that you show in the memory of Patrick. Um, even years after it, when we get together on days like this, it's nice to look around and see the uh, continued support that the community and the whole tri-state area continues to bring. And it's a blessing to be able to see so many people uh, looking after their family even a couple years into it. On a personal note, one thing I've thought about uh, for me what this sign means is all of us here have heard of Patrick and we know his legacy and his story and we've talked to our family members about that. And years down the line, the story will fade, and this will be a continued reminder. And I can imagine that years down the line or generations down the line, maybe a small kid or a teenager will see this sign, see Patrick's name, and ask their parents, hey, what was this about? Who is Patrick Walterman? Let's hear his story. And this will be a way to get that years down the line to be able to be voiced again, to know not only what happened back then, but who Patrick was. Um, the, husband that he was, the son, the brother, the uncle, and what a great overall person he was. And I hope that this sign is a continued reminder for years to come. So once again, thanks for all the support. Thanks to uh, Wes Rutherford for everything he's done for us and for the city of Hamilton for allowing this sign to be dedicated. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, Tony Harris, who's the president of the Firefighters Union for Hamilton Fire Department. I just want to thank everybody for coming out today. It's uh, and we see what a, a horrible day it is for weather, but we still have a packed house here. We had to put up more tents to get everybody under it, and it just goes to show the the sacrifice and the uh, life that Patrick led. He was very much loved by his family. He's very much loved by his friends, and he's a hero to all of us as brothers and sisters at the uh, at the fire department. Um, you know, the, the beautiful thing about this is. You know, those that worked with him we and his family and his friends, they, they won't need a sign to remember Patrick. They remember Patrick every single day. But now, 
like Isaac said and others have said, as people drive into town, they're going to see Patrick's name up there and they're going to wonder, you know, what he did. And if they don't know what he did, they may take the time to look up what he did, allowing us to remember every day his sacrifice. And it's just a, a, fitting, a fitting honor to, to a guy who's a hero to all of us that, that he'll never be forgotten by us, but now he'll never be forgotten by everybody that enters this town. So it's, uh, it's much appreciated. It's, it's, we're very thankful to Wes for pushing us through and very thankful for Isaac and his work along with, uh, along with Wes to help get this done. And uh, just thank you all for coming out. We, we appreciate you being here. Thank you. I, I also want to extend uh, my thanks to uh, Chief Bukite of the Hamilton Police Department, who's back in the background there, uh, and his police department, along with Mike Moser and his prosecutor's office for the fine work they did and prosecuting the two men that were responsible for this heinous act. Um, and, on, and to the family, uh, his lovely wife, Bree, and his parents, Don, Debbie, on behalf of this whole community, everybody standing here and everybody that's gonna drive by in the future, thank you so much for what your son and your husband did for this community. And also thank you for allowing me to represent him by wearing this shirt uh, today. And it is my distinct honor to formally dedicate in his memory the Patrick Walterman Memorial Highway.